Spring Street Shipyard, March 30th, 2022. Getting ready for spring, getting ready to finish off our 41 foot hunt boat that we've been working on for a year now. We're gonna be putting the deck on very soon. This is our first yacht finished off. It's gonna be really exciting. It's a super owner, great to work with. The crew is really excited because it is such a nice high quality boat. So everybody's putting their great effort into making everything just right. And it's gonna be a, a fantastic running boat because it's a hunt and it's going to be a great comfortable boat and do exactly what the owner wants us to do, which is fantastic. And while we're trying to do all that, we're also trying to get all the boats finished up from our winter projects and get them ready to go into the summer for a great cruising ground up here in Maine. Hopefully a lot more people will join us up here this summer coming up. We've got a very busy crew and a very busy spring ahead of us. And we have two more Muscle Ridge, a 42 and a 46, sitting outside waiting to come inside to finish those boats off. We also have a Bide coming in, which is 136 foot yonger. So that's gonna have a major refit starting at the end of April. So it's gonna be a crazy summer, a crazy fall. We're pretty well booked into next winter now. When she arrived, the hull paint was in pretty rough shape. So six months ago, we completed the new paint job. The owner requested that we change the color of the boot and the cove stripes, which really came out lovely. The deck was really rough from years of wear and tear. So we went through and we just gave the whole deck a light sanding to kind of get back to a nice flat surface and bring back some of that teak color. And she looks great. One complaint the owner had was that under power, especially he couldn't see over the Dodger. Um, while, while steering the boat. So he wanted to come up with a solution for that. So what we ended up coming up with was these removable steering platforms that in this position, they have a 15 degree angle. So when you're, when you're steering under sail, you have a comfortable flat surface to stand on. But when under power, there's a kickstand that comes up and that gives you a five and a half inch lift so you can see over the Dodger. And then, when he wants to get rid of them, simply pull them out of the way, and they're gone. This machine is, as far as I know, is the largest bed on the eastern seaboard. For the shipyard itself, we can in-house cut anything from tanks to hull plates to intricate pieces. It's a five-axis head. The bed is 20 feet wide by 40 feet long. It's got an add-on lathe on the end of it that we can cut pipe with and bevel. As far as the manufacturing part of it, we have outside companies that reach out to us all the time to do big projects, small projects. It's an amazing machine and takes a lot of the handwork away from if you had to cut pieces by hand and then shape them. It's much more time and cost efficient.